Okay, hey guys, um, we're going to be doing a general reading for Libra. And uh, hey, if you guys could uh, subscribe to my channel, I would really appreciate that. And if you like the video, if you could give it a like and uh, comments are always welcomed. Okay, so first we're going to start off with the Dragon Oracle here, which I've already pulled here. And it's the Golden Atlantean Dragon. And it says, helps you remember the wisdom of golden Atlantis. Awaken, bring back your knowledge, gifts, and talents. Reclaim your mastery. Okay. Let's start off here with the Ten of Wands. And the Ten of Wands is, a. Uh, it could be working too hard or too many hours. And you could be feeling a little bit overburdened maybe under pressure uh, saying need some balance which other cards here also kind of indicate needing some balance and the next card is the devil she's the devil <laughs> okay anyway, the devil card it's uh, choices and consequences so it's an accept responsibilities for your choices and could also be having a lot of fear or worry about something. By the way, we have fire signs here, earth signs, air signs. And let's see. Okay. Next we have the wheel which is the wheel of fortune and the wheel of fortune it's a positive change so end of delays and could be a lucky break and it could be a fresh new start okay next we have the queen of wands and the queen of wands uh, is ambitious and talented and it's saying to trust your instincts and there's nothing you can't do listen to your gut and the Empress card is next and the Empress also uh, can say you know to trust your instincts but it's same time to take action and she represents abundance and also could uh, represent marriage and pregnancy but it does indicate that you are on the right track here and we have a couple twos here and the number two indicates partnerships and harmony and balance so yeah needing some balance here so the two of pentacles and it's um, basically a balance that you need to <laughs> you need balance of with home and work or you know balancing maybe you're juggling different jobs or your resources but it's saying to maybe try and have a little bit of fun Next is the Two of Wands. And the Two of Wands is taking the next steps and like putting in effort and could be partnership or collaboration. Okay, next is the Page of Swords. And the Page of Swords indicates kind of like a blunt person, but very intelligent very curious very truthful and also indicates to walk away if there's any gossip being going on just kind of walk away from gossip next is the nine of wands and the nine of wands it says to keep going don't stop perseverance is key 
and to be prepared. And also there could be some deception going on somewhere. And so just be aware. If your gut is telling you something's a little off, you are right, it is off. Okay, I'm going to pull one of these Law of Attraction cards here. And this one says, life is always working out for me. And then there's a back. I like understanding that things are always evolving. And while there are many things that could be better where I am, it is not really a problem because where I am is constantly changing to something better. I like knowing that as I look for the best things around me where I am, those things become more prevalent in my experience. It is fun to know that things are always working out for me, and as I watch for the evidence of that, I see more evidence of that every day. That's nice. Okay, Libra. This is the reading I have for you for this week. Again, if you can subscribe, I would really appreciate that. And give it a like if you liked it, and if you want to leave a comment, do so. Alright, thanks a lot, you guys.